update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of a very sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update. we got a mixed bag. We have mixed bags nearly every day these days. Dow's off 184, while the S&P's up 10 and the NASDAQ 100 is up 130. The Russell's off 7. The semis are up 33. Trendies are back 185. You've got gold trading off $5, trading out of 23.39. Silver's down 28 pennies. Lights we crude is up 3 cents. Natural gas is back 7 cents. 30-year treasury print out of 120.04. That's up 4 ticks. Let's figure out what all this means by looking at that 9 panel. Market update chart will begin with the ES Mini upper left-hand side. What do we know about it? It has a TD9 count top with a, uh, a new profile, profile that formed a few days ago. Price is testing the support level, which is down at 53, oops, uh, down at 55.12. A price close of low, 55.12. Now, I have to look at my other, we'll take a look at the white background charts. They may have a lower profile than that, so we'll certainly take a look at it. But at this stage of the game here, this profile has held as support. We have a spot biotinics that has attempted for the last two days to get above and close above its 50-day exponential moving average. Right now, it's trading back below that level. That level being 1332. The spot is trading at 1322. That provides a wind at the back of the S&P 500, the ES Mini. So support holding and resistance inside the uh, spot VIX is also holding out there. If we take a look at the NQ, it does have different profile levels on my black background system. I believe it is 19.802 is the uh, price level, which we did close below yesterday. Today, but if we close back above that, I'm going to call this a false move to the downside signal. If we take a look at that U.S. dollar index, it is attempting to form a new daily profile. That new daily profile has got resistance up at the 105.47 level, support down at 104.81. Gold is consolidating with inside its profiles. Nothing changed there. That's between 23.14 and 23.86. Silver remains above the top of its daily profile. Uh, the bottom has been tested. That's at 28. 2864. All this suggests that as long as profile support is going to hold, that silver wants to trade higher. In the case of Light Sweet Crude, if it closes the day above 81.79, that's its TD9 count top that formed a couple of days ago. It would negate that signal, and that would tell us about a strong move to the upside. With price targeting this most recent swing high, that's back on the trading session of April the 12th. That's up at the 85.27 level. That's coming from that August contract. Natural gas. Consolidation with inside its daily profile out there. It did test basically reject support yesterday down at 276. If you take a look at that 30 year treasury, it's got to sell the D point pattern. That would be negated with a close of 120.24. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Edge show. But if you have to start your Tuesday, please have a terrific one. Thanks for joining us. We'll look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care. Now.